Do we want to give kind of a little spoiler-free synopsis? Yeah, you do it. (laughs) (laughs) You know, I have a friend who talks about one thing that he thinks, um, you know, makes a really good movie is the same thing that makes a very good short story. And he thinks that what makes a very good short story is if you're able to sum it up in a sentence or two and you'll you'll say, you know, the one where. And I feel like this movie is very, very easy to sum up in a very short number of words or you can, you know, elaborate a lot. Well, I'm waiting. (laughs) So is the rest of the listening audience. Right. So um, Shoko is a new student at a school. It's an elementary school. And she introduces herself by writing on um, a notepad. This is going to be way longer than a sentence. I can already tell. This is way... The way that you're starting this off, it's going to be way longer than a sentence. (laughs) So she introduces, introduces herself on a notepad to say that she's deaf. One kid kind of takes an interest in her, um, bit of a bully, by which I mean an absolute sadist, <laughs> as it turns out. Um, so this kid bullies her terribly until she ends up transferring schools. Mm-hmm. Um, and then he spends the rest of the movie in his older life trying to find her and make up for the pain that he caused in her youth. It's about four or five sentences, Kat. You failed. I can't believe you're <laughs> bullying me right now. That's so meta. But it was a good summation of the movie. A very good summation. That's a, <laughs> a good uh, paragraph of summation. But yeah, that's... The next thing that happens in the movie is that Joe goes and fucks himself. <laughs> I don't remember that part. 